tonight. People around the region are cleaning up after four tornadoes touched down overnight. These are just some of the scenes from western Pennsylvania, Ohio and West Virginia. The worst of the weather came through overnight. And that's an extremely dangerous time for tornadoes to hit. This video shows why it's pitch black outside and it's not until lightning illuminates the sky that a funnel cloud can be seen just over the tree line there. KDK's Jennifer Barreso is live from where that tornado hit with some insight from a local fire chief on the dangers of storms hitting when most of us are asleep. Jen. And it's not about just the tornado you might not see, but it's about all the debris it's throwing around. Now, behind me, a metal roof ripped off. Duquesne Light saying that part of it found on 376. That's why experts say it's important for everybody to listen to severe weather before they sleep, to be ready to react in moments. As we're cleaning up today, we keep saying we're here and our house is in one piece. Patty Langer's one of the lucky ones. This massive funnel cloud caught on a ring doorbell camera, touched down right next to her Finley Township home in the middle of the night, toppling trees, ripping a steel roof off of a nearby business and flinging it onto 376. But Langer heeded the alerts and escaped to the basement just in time. Shut everything off. I grabbed him by the door. I go, we're going downstairs now. And he was like, what? I, it, it passed. I said, no, it didn't. Downstairs now. It's going right over our house. According to the Weather Channel, a recent study found nighttime tornadoes are more than twice as likely to be deadly. Cannonsburg Volunteer Fire Chief Tim Solibai describes the unique dangers at night. Oftentimes you can't see what's, what's coming. You know, and once you start hearing it, it may be a little bit too late to get, get to anywhere to safety, but obviously you still need to try. Experts say you should have more than one way to get a tornado alert, like a NOAA weather radio and a smartphone, something that can wake you up if you're asleep and take them seriously. Don't ignore them. You've got to pay attention to the alerts and the alarms when they go off. All I can say is, listen, when you guys say, Go to the basement, go. Because we were only there within five minutes when yeah. it hit. Now, despite all the damage from last night's tornadoes, there is a bit of good news. We have gotten no reports of anybody killed or seriously hurt. Reporting live, Jennifer Barrasso, KDK TV News.